In the, back in the 90s, we had a really good TV show for everyone. It is good for kids and adults. And it was on PBS Kids. That's why, ladies and gentlemen, even though I'm late for the party for this one, I'm talking about Awful. So Awful is a TV... Well, actually, no. Awful is a book series. I mean, it was first made as a book by a guy named Mark Brown, who is the creator of both the book series and the TV show. It was supposed to be a graphic novel, but then PBS um, bought, bought, the, bought the rights to it, and now it is a TV show. Um, it is about an old boat named Arthur, and he has a sis two sisters that are named Kate and D.W. And, um, and he, and he has a mother and a father who are also old adults. And it has plenty different other types of characters. It sometimes goes into serious topics, but it still talks about everyday topics. Kind of like, for example, don't you get in to peer pressure, um, do not steal, um, be kind to your loved ones, and other types of stuff like that. It is a very good TV show. That it is a very good TV series, and um, like most TV series that last long, um, it has like a few bad episodes from here and there. For example, um, All Foods Big Hit, um, didn't have a very good message. And, um, the message was supposed to be, please do not hit your siblings, or that punching people is bad, but it kind of messed up its moral a, li a little bit. And there are other few examples that um, have like bad episodes and also such as um, So Funny I Forgot to Laugh and DW's um, Very Bad Mood. But those are only the bad episodes that everyone thinks about when it goes to this show. Um, those are only the three episodes that anyone can only think about Awful, but in reality, Awful is a really good show, in my opinion. Um, it's basically supposed to be like an educational show by teaching people, um, you can use your imagination, um, everything's, um, amazing. Um, but Yellow are memorable. Um, my favorite Yellow is, um, I want to say Bustle. Why? Because, like me, I eat a lot. And, um, he also makes up stories, kind of like I do sometimes. And, yeah. Um,. So, you might be wondering, why am I talking about Awful? Well, the reason why I'm talking about Awful is that last week was the show's final episode. Yes, I'm not making this up. Last week was the show's final episode. And that's what we're going to be talking about today. So the final episode is called Alt Won't Up. Please do not get confused by the What What's reboot called Alt Won't Up. Yeah. Anyways, so I actually love these shows that showed Hilda's growing up, which is a message from TV shows saying that you grow up with this kind of show. Kind of like um, Dragon Ball Z, My Little Pony G Generation 4, Friendship is Magic, Wait Little Show. I want to say Adventure Time, but I might be wrong about that. But anyways, 
I actually like TV shows do that and showing us that um, we grew up with these type of heroes for the past few years. And um, it's about Arthur and his friends playing a board game at the library. And we got to see see what the the kids' um, future is going to be. Like, for example, um, Muffy is going to be, like, a, um, I want to say, like, an accountant. Um, Buster's future is that he's going to be a teacher or so-and-so. And um, the episode time skips to 20 years later, and um, we see that how it was all blown up. And um, it was actually really nice. We actually see them having a really good time um, in the future with their, with their new lives, which um, the show is trying to tell us that growing up can sometimes be hard, but we all have to do it. We all have to see what else we can do with our lives and other kinds of stuff. And sometimes it's good and sometimes it's bad. But most of the times, you're going to meet amazing good friends and have a little at your time or bad time or whatever. It's your, it's your own decision. That's what the show is trying to teach you. Anyways, um, so spoilers. If you haven't seen the episode, go download PBS Kids app. Or go to YouTube. They have it on YouTube as well. So in the ending of the episode, we see Awful all blown up. And he had a different voice actor. And in case you're wondering, it was the very first voice actor of the show that started it all, started it all from season one to season five. And I thought that was a very good idea. And um, he said um, he likes drawing animals because um, the um, book that he checked out in the library was How to Draw Animals. And um, we see Awful telling a story about his, his life. That's what it showed in the ending of the final episode. Um, so anyways, this was a really good show. It teaches you everything about life, how to be kind to other people, and sometimes the show has the very good celebrities such as um, Lance Armstrong, um, Mr. Waddles, um, who else was in this show? Those are the only two that you think yet, but please let me know in the comments if you know um, other celebrities have been in Alpha, because I do know that there were a lot of celebrities have been in Alpha. And um, one more thing before I go. I want to say thank you, Mark Brown. Thank you. This has been a wonderful 25 years, and it was amazing that this show existed in everyone's childhood from 96 to 2022. And um, I thought is a, it, it was a very good experience. It taught us a lot of how to be nice old to people and everyone else around us, how to be um, independent. And this show has been amazing. And we hope we, we hope we can see you again soon also. And you too, Mark Brown. Thank you, Mark Brown. This has been an amazing 25 years. 
in everyone's childhood. Okay, so... Yeah. Oh, wait, one more thing. I'm pretty sure you all want to know what what my favorite, um, Alpha episode is. Well, it's been a while since I've seen the show, but to be honest, it would have to be, uh, that one episode when they first met Mr. Watborn. That's my favorite episode. And, um, let me know your favorite episodes in the comment section. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hope you have a wonderful day. Did you grew up with this show? Did you like this show? Um, did you enjoy this show when you were a kid? Yes, yes I did, but I want to know if you, if you guys enjoyed this show when you were kids, or if you still watch reruns about it. Uh, let me know in the comment section. And yeah, always be a champion. Like, comment, and subscribe. Um, next time, I'm going to be doing a top five WrestleMania match list. Um, it's going to be top, it's going to be a top five Undertaker's best street matches at WrestleMania. And then, after that, I'm going to be reviewing 2K22, the video game. Yes, that is right. Next week, WWE 2K22, the video game, is coming out. I'm so excited. It is amazing. I've been waiting. I mean, we've been waiting for a long time for this game. So, it's going to be awesome. I'm so excited. And I can't wait to play GM mode. All right, hope you have a wonderful day. Always be a champion. And I'm out.